Second down and a dozen. Trying to set up that screen underneath. Pass is caught there by Kenny McIntyre. VP with those 12 catches. Inside handoff. This will be taken by Kenny McIntosh. Full head of steam. McIntosh to midfield. Hurdles a man and dropped around the 45. So nice. A lot to be happy about right now is Arkansas up by five. Kenny McIntosh flipped up at the 40-yard line. Run it with Kenny McIntosh. That's uh, some CAT scans and found there was a cyst on his brain. So a couple hours later, he's on the surgery table. He's got a scar to look at sometimes, thinking about how much pain that must have caused him. But they got it cleared up, and uh, he's out here running around, throwing the football. It's and the kickoff is going to be returnable by Kenny McIntosh from the four. Works the sidelines, a bolt of speed, shoves a man out of the way, and that's a good look for last year's meeting. So he wants to make a, a big impact tonight. They hand it off inside, and this is McIntosh spinning, and he's got a first down yardage near the third. Out smoke Monday back there. 49 yard gain, and the dogs are threatening to blow this thing open before the. Clearing that out, taking the two defenders. McIntosh spun down. Pickens a quiet night, just two for 26 yards. And there's another run. And McIntosh takes his turn and pressing into the secondary. Right. Out again, McIntosh on the edge. Cuts it back, slips a tackle, and he'll pick up two yards. So it's second and 25. And they hand it off inside to McIntosh. He's rolling right and flips it underneath, and that's McIntosh on the run. Takes a big shot, knocked down at the third. Career high game for him last week against the Tigers from the 48 first down. This one's down the seam. Ooh, big hit. Back in the, in the end zone. Kevin McIntosh. Good run off the left side. He's going to get about 13 out of it. After that. Got it all the way to midfield. He'll try it again. Successful again, almost has to take over for Johnson's a true freshman in Tyler Barrel. Barron, excuse me, down the seam. Complete McIntosh still on his feet. First and goal, Georgia around the two. You cannot get beat inside. That's where you're vulnerable. Bake him outside. He lets him inside. The defense is gashed when that happens. You can live with getting beat outside if you're a coach, but when you get beat inside, there's nobody to help. Georgia with a first and goal. They this time they'll keep it on the ground and they're going to lose yardage. that time. Rosamese, Jack Saint, and Jermaine Burton. They're going to throw the pitch to the near side. Good run. Pick up of it's Patrick one of those tight ends was in motion and now blocks back the other way. McIntosh leaving his way through traffic. That's what it really was. See, we've seen this happen before. Have we ever? Patient, patient, and then go. Very nice run. Always oh, looks like it. A third and nine. A slip pass out to McIntosh. Kenny McIntosh short of the first down by about a foot. Stetson Bennett lofts one. McIntosh trying to make a one. Kick off. Going to be returned. Little hesitation back there on McIntosh now. Breaks it down the sideline, cuts back in, and all the way out to the 41-yard line. Behind Bennett, on first and goal at the five. He'll get the carry. He got hit in the backfield, but now cuts it to the far side with a step arm. He's still going to be bulldog down and around the line. It's enough to really happen. Broadway, blocker is in front of McIntosh, who gets back to the 16-yard line. Whoa, and there's a shove, almost a punch. By Trayvon Flowers at the end. Bennett draw play, McIntosh going to be brought down for a loss again. The field on first down, he'll get the carry. Out about four. It's hard not to try it, right? Yep. McIntosh again puts his shoulder down and he's still going. Into Alabama territory. The quarterback, you know, who started the year fourth or fifth string. First kick. Fielded at the five by McIntosh. Oh, man. Hello.
This one taken just outside the five by McIntosh. Kenny McIntosh. Nice return out around the 33 yard line. George expected them to be this year, but tonight they have met their match with the front of Mississippi State. He does it again. Watch the penetration here. Look, it, they, they got a gap in a, a guy in each gap, nowhere for Jay, for McIntosh to go. Picks up five. Daniels 23 of 29 for 294. They'll hand it off to Kenny McIntosh. They will rush three and drop eight. They'll go a little delay handoff to McIntosh. He'll get it to the 40-yard line. Way to the ground. Nobody can question his talent. This is Kenny McIntosh, and McIntosh will get maybe a thumb is banged up. This is a handoff to McIntosh, and McIntosh has the first down as he is a pile carry. A split zone. Watch Trey McKinney on the backside. Nice push. Nice push right at the point of attack. Unsurprising. Well, we talked about it coming into this one. McIntosh again with wide open space in front of him. Cuts it back inside the 25, down near the 20. Before. It's pretty good vision. You see him nice cut back. That hole was about four yards wide, right along the line of scrimmage. Main contributor in the passing game. McIntosh, no place to go, somehow gets something out of nothing. Alyssa, I see Jamari Sawyer back out there. That was a seven and a half of any team in the conference. White out, McIntosh in, and tackled immediately. Turn. And it's McIntosh eluding the tackle, cutting it back to the middle of the field, and he's inside the tip. Relative to what we saw last Saturday. Yeah, it hasn't had to tonight. Just 8 of 11 passing as they go back to McIntosh, eluding the tacklers. Look, he almost took a face mask there. Mac McIntosh, without any problem, moves the chains. Back to the ground, McIntosh with those huge holes all night. This is 10 more for just ground game, but that's been what it is tonight. McIntosh stumbles, but gets inside the 10 yard line. There's a line up in the eye formation. Handoff left side, they'll give it to McIntosh. He breaks a tackle, falls forward, has the... Sixth play of this drive, they've all been on the ground. You can keep it on the ground here. McIntosh with that little pitch and a touch. And they catch Missouri in a little tempo here, a little quick toss to the outside, and they get the edge, they get the corner, get a hat on a hat into easy. Their own 10-yard line, leading by a touchdown. JT Daniels has yet to throw as Georgia continues to run it this time. Unbelievable. Georgia will go first and 10, couple of tight ends. They will hand it off inside. That will go to... They'll swing it near side. McIntosh, first down and more. A big collision around the map when he goes out in motion. You see how far inside Nicholson. Defensively for Missouri, had a career high five stops last week. Handoff, McIntosh to midfield, driving a couple of guys with him. McIntosh trying to get that line he needs. Now on the ground for White. Two tight end set for the Bulldogs on first down and 10. And Matt Robertson in motion. Here goes Kenny McIntosh. Nice little stutter step. Frees him up on the near side. And there's a vision here. Watch him set this up. There's a backer right there outside. And he comes and gives him that little dead leg and bounces back outside. And he'll be on the end of that particular. That's what was Missouri, and they've been able to run it and throw it. Handoff goes to McIntosh. Bounces it to the outside, gets it. Little stutter step in the backfield. 